Hi everyone, welcome to this uh, Illustrator tutorial. In this video, I wanted to show you how you can go about customizing your sh uh, keyboard shortcuts within Illustrator. Like many others, I like to use shortcuts uh, to help get through my work uh, workflow faster. It really does help me to edit and create my designs quicker. So to do this, uh, you go to edit uh, and then you click on the keyboard shortcut um, uh, here and this will open up the dialog box. Now here are the two areas you can go and uh, customize your uh, shortcuts. There's the menu commands which is up along here along the top here and here they are here as well so I can expand them out and go into them and as you can see some have shortcuts and some don't. Then there's the tools menu and as you can see some have shortcuts and some don't. Now to, uh, I'm going to show you how you can add your own or create your own uh, um, shortcut. So for the purpose of this video, I'm going to go into menu command. I'm going to go to file and I'm going to go to export because I do a lot of exporting. Now to one thing to take note is that I'm using a MacBook keyboard. So the, uh, the, uh, the key icons will, uh, will be different to a Windows system. So let's get started. So I'm going to go with command P. Now I did that purposefully because I wanted to show you this. There's a conflict. It's saying that it's already been used. Now you can go and uh, overwrite it with this, and what it'll do is it'll overwrite the uh, the it'll overwrite this uh, uh, shortcut and then add this shortcut to this new one here. But my recommendation is don't do that. Leave the default. Just add your own. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to undo click back in there again and I'm going to go command 9 and as you can see the 9 the command 9 doesn't have a conflict so I'm going to click OK now this dialog box will appear just to, so you can give it a name now it'll only it, sh um, uh, it should only appear because this is this is the first time I'm adding a shortcut next time you add another shortcut uh, it, it will not appear because you just keep adding it to the same to this same uh, uh, shortcuts uh, list. Click OK. Now I'm going to click on Command 9 and there it popped up uh, the export uh, dialog box. That's how easy it is guys. One more thing I want to show you is if you want to refer uh, revert back to the uh, defaults you go to edit keyboard and in this drop down here see this is the one we created and here is the default and you click OK and now what is done it's taken everything back to the default when it was initially uh, how it was initially installed that's it guys I hope you got something out of this um, um, please feel free to comment uh, in, in the comments below any feedback I'm always happy to hear from you guys if you're new to my channel please hit that subscribe button and that bell icon to be notified of more videos coming up I also want to let you know that I did a uh, shortcut customization for Photoshop. I will put that link in the in the comments uh, in the uh, description section below as well. And if you like this video, please give it a like. It'll certainly help on the on the platform. And yeah, thanks for watching.